This is the Galaxy Watch, and this is Samsung's newest high-end smartwatch, and I'm just gonna say this, it's better than the Apple Watch. This watch doesn't have a huge cult following like the Apple Watch, but it really does outperform it in almost every single way. So first, let's talk about the design of the watch, and that's a very important aspect of something you're gonna wear on your wrist. And this is a very masculine and iconic and classic looking watch. The chassis is made out of metal and the rotating dial feels very premium. Now this watch is made out of some plastic, but that just rests on your wrist and you never notice it. Now I have the band that came with this watch and it's pretty nice. It's equivalent to the sport band from Apple. It's made out of this rubbery material and I really like the hook and latch mechanism. So if you're gonna buy this watch, you really don't have to replace the band, it comes with a great one. Okay, so something I briefly mentioned earlier is the rotating dial and this is probably the best part of this watch. With this dial, you can control every scrolling part of the UI, you could access different apps, and overall just control the watch without touching the screen. Now even though there's a mechanical piece to the watch, it's still water resistant, meaning you could swim with it, and it's IP68 to be exact. In relation to swimming, this watch also has a lot of health and fitness features. You could track your stress, measure your heart rate, and even check calories burned. If you're not active for a long period of time, the watch will actually notify you and tell you to do some weird sort of exercise, like torso twist, which is... Very interesting. Now let's talk about the OLED panel on this watch. And in my opinion, it looks really good. Colors are bright and vivid and everything is nice and saturated. I can't see any pixels. Now let's dive under the display and talk about the software. And this watch is running Samsung's Tizen OS. I describe this experience as fluid, intuitive, and easy to use. Once you get the hang of it, you really can't go back to any other operating system. <laughs> watch it less. <laughs> now once again, what really complements this operating system is the rotating dial. When you rotate left, you can see your notifications, and when you rotate right, you can see all your widgets. It's really simple and really intuitive. Also, there's two buttons that are used to interact with the watch. One is the back button, and the other one's the home button. When you click the home button, you can easily access all your apps, and let's talk about apps, because there's not a huge selection. Now, where the Apple Watch really shines is in the vast array of apps you can download. This watch, on the other hand, doesn't have too many, but my most favorite app is definitely Spotify. You can play music straight off of the watch, which is pretty cool. But overall, this watch is for somebody who wants that iconic watch look without sacrificing any smart features. Now, the problem with the Apple Watch is that it doesn't really look like a watch. It looks more like a tiny iPad that you're wearing on your wrist, and I find that to be awkward and not good looking. This on the other hand is stylish, packs a lot of cool features, and is cheaper than the Apple Watch. Overall, buy the Galaxy Watch for its looks and ease of use, and buy the Apple Watch for the vast amount of apps it has. But yeah, thanks for watching this quick review. Please remember to hit the subscribe button and the bell icon. I really appreciate it. And yeah, the Galaxy Watch is one of the best watches of 2019, and I definitely recommend it. Thanks for watching. Catch you guys in the next one.